Tell me why I already cracked. <laughs> In half. No! <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. First of all, it is so cold outside. It's like actually winter. I said it's supposed to snow on Wednesday and I'm so not ready for it. If you are a human on this planet, then you have heard of the show Squid Game. I'm not even really sure like where it came from. Like that's my biggest question is like, how did this show like become a thing? Like it's good, I watched it. It just seems weird to me that it, like all of a sudden was just like, boom, Squid Games, I don't know. Anyway, I'm currently on episode four. I know I'm behind everybody. I've seen a lot of like TikTok videos of people trying to do the honeycomb challenge, which if you're unfamiliar with it, it's one of the games that they play pretty much the preference of the show is that these people come to like a island where they compete for money and they compete through kid games that are like taken to the extreme. This game is called the honeycomb challenge and they're given like a little like piece of honeycomb with a shape in it and they have to like shit out with a needle without breaking it and if they break it then they lose. So I've seen a ton of people trying to do it so I thought I would try to do it today to see how easy it is to make. Oh no, no, this is so hard. And how easy it is to play. I'll see what we got. First things first, let's go to the store and see if we can find everything. Okay, so I just picked up the stuff from Walmart to like make it, and now I ran to the craft store to find cookie cutters. And I'm picking out what shapes I want. I definitely think I should do like circle, since that's in the show, star. So I couldn't find a triangle or an umbrella. So I picked two other shapes that I think are gonna be around the same difficulty level. We'll see. I'm gonna head back home and we're gonna start making them. Back in the kitchen and I got all the stuff. So let me walk you and y'all through the recipe. I believe what you do is you melt a little bit of sugar until like it turns brown and you just do that in like a pot. And then you add a pinch of baking soda and then you pour it onto a sheet that is lined with parchment paper or wax paper. Press it down and then press the thing into it and then you let it cool. Doesn't seem too challenging, but I have seen a bunch of TikToks of people like not doing it right and like it being hard. So we're gonna make sure that we do it correctly because I really want to try this and see if I can get it to work. I'm like kind of nervous. Like I feel like it's gonna be a lot harder than than like it seems to be. We'll see. I also got some needles. So I picked out. So they're a little bit bigger. Let's start melting the sugar. Okay, so the problem is I'm not entirely sure like how much sugar I should be using. So I'm just gonna kind of like eyeball it and like hope for the best. I think that's enough. I feel like there should be like something else other than sugar in here. Okay, we got something happening now. Looks like it's melting a little bit. So to stir vigorously, so that is what I'm doing. I feel like I did not use enough. So this is like crystallizing onto the chopstick. I definitely feel like I still don't have enough. We'll just test it and see. Okay, I'm gonna add some baking soda now. Whoa, whoa. Wow, okay, so that expands. Transferring it over. Okay. First try, not too bad. Now I know kind of what I'm doing. I definitely added too much baking soda. I'm gonna try again, add some more sugar. We got it this time. Okay, we got it melting again. Definitely the hard part is how much baking soda you're supposed to add, because that went fast. This is like an art, like this is hard. It's melted. I'm gonna try this again. A little pitch. Transfer. And now we press. Oh no, no. <laughs> this is so hard. Okay, I got the transfer down this time. I just need to oil this thing up. Take three. Here we go. Whew. 
Okay, so it has been like 30 minutes. And I've literally failed like 10 times. It's so hard. Like half of them on my burn, half of them weren't big enough, but I finally got one that's like perfect. So I'm gonna try to redo it like four times, make four of different shapes. Then we're gonna go from there. It is so hard. Like it is way harder than it looks. So don't underestimate this. It's almost harder to make than I think it is to actually play the game. So difficult. Okay, I'm on like my sixth round of making these and I think I found out the trick. You have to start with like medium heat. You need more sugar than like you'd expect. Like I'm using like about a fourth of a cup, like less than a fourth cup, but, like more than a like sprinkle of sugar. It does expand when you have the baking soda in there though. So start with about a medium heat, add the sugar in, let it melt, then reduce the heat and stir it like a lot. And so it kind of cools down a little bit because if you put the baking soda in right away, it burns it and then it turns into like that. This is the one that I made that's pretty good. I'm gonna try to fill the whole <laughs> thing this time. But that is my trick. You also have to move really fast, so that's why it's kind of hard to like film it because you don't have very much time from the time that you put the baking soda in to when it's done. So, I don't know if you can see that this is melting. You want it to be like a dark brown. I'm like so close, but I just have so little time in between those two like press smash. That's the hardest part. So as I'm cooking over here, I hear like a snap. It literally just broke, like broke on the circle. So I guess it's a good thing, but it broke. I literally just made the perfect one. Do you see that? Also my circle just keeps breaking like naturally. I don't like, I don't know what happened. Like it just like broke out of its thing. So I guess that means I win, question mark. Okay, we're here with my first one, my first one that succeeded. That's what it looks like. I'm gonna try to break this. Tell me why I already cracked it. <laughs> Tell me why I already lost it. Let's just pretend that didn't happen. I'm gonna try the needle technique. Oh my. Literally <laughs> in half. Literally, I just broke it in half. <laughs> that is so bad. Wow, so basically I lost. <laughs> it's easy to like snap, watch. You see that? It's like easy to break along the line. But I feel like you have to have made it correctly and like, I feel like mine are so fragile. Wow, that is so difficult. Tastes like I'm just eating sugar. Let me try the next one. Okay, here we have a star again. This one by far was my best shape, like best cutout. So we'll see if I don't break it. It's just so fragile. Like, I don't know if y'all can see this, but it's just so, so thin. Oh, 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 okay. I got a hole. Oh, no, no. Do not crack on me. Let me try the breaking method. Oh, that was clean. See that? Okay, that's pretty good. <laughs> no! It's the one that I just vacuumed. If I'm being honest, I'm not even sure how that happened. Literally, it is all over the place. No, that is so sad. I feel like with the round corners, it might be easiest to break it. Okay, so with the exception of that one part, I got it. What I still lost, yes. Did I at least get close? Yes. Okay, this here's my last one. Circle, didn't really end up proportional, but. shocked at how many people actually got it in the show because that is difficult. I spoke too soon saying it would be easy to make. That was the most challenging part. It was fun to like try in real life. Also pick the circle if you ever are in Squid Games in real life because that's the easiest one. That was intense. 
I want to see y'all try to do this, so the recipe open in the description box down below. What I bought, what I used, my tips and tricks. Let me know how it goes for y'all, because this is so hard. It is definitely kind of cool to like try things from a different culture. I think that's the fun part about the show, is like we're getting a lot of insight from another culture, and like it's fun to try things, so this is fun. And like I can see this being really fun for kids, so cool idea, cool show, very hard in real life. I did win one out of four, failed on making like 10 of them before that, but hey, we got one, so. <laughs> All right, I will see you guys next week. Bye.